we discussed already, you do, you do a lot of uh, remixes. Uh, I think that's uh, today also uh, for all the different kind of radio stations you have in the world. You have a version like this, a ballad version, R&B version, rap version, etc. Mm -hmm. uh, do you think that the whole uh, new album, uh, The Butterfly, we're going to have uh, 20 new remixes or 30? Or what do you think? Not 30 unless someone else is going to get in there and do them. Because I ain't doing 30. No? How much, how much did you do? See, this is the thing. When I do remixes, it's a different thing. Like, I've worked with David Morales for like four years mm -hmm. now. And when we do remixes, I go in, I recut my vocals, I rewrite my melody, I sometimes have to rewrite the lyrics. And I take them very seriously. And we have a lot, I mean, I take them seriously, but we have a lot of fun when we do them. And it's a totally different creative outlet. It's a totally different way of singing. Um, and a lot of people just give the remix to their song and go, here you go, make it what you want. But I care about my music so much that I don't like to let it go. So I've been doing it for a while and it's a great outlet for me. It's not like I'm jumping on the bandwagon. I've, I've been doing that for like four years, so right. nothing new to me. Talking about the remix on the roof, uh, what, 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 what makes it so special for you? Uh, the one with Mob Deep? Yeah. Well, because the roof, um, the actual song, came from an idea which was a loop of a record called Shook Ones by Mob Deep, which is like basically like a hip hop classic. And I was listening to it over and over and that's when I got the idea to loop that record. I did it with the track masters who did it, like Nas, Foxy Brown, The Firm, whatever. Um, and I told them I wanted to use that and nobody had done it. And um, so we, we, you know, I wrote the song over that and then we changed it m melodically a little bit. And um, the remix was very important for me to have Mob Deep on there because that's they were the original inspiration for that record.